ask your parents to leave the room. You don't want them seeing what we're about to show you. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our top 10 most disgusting games. For this list, we're looking at video games from various platforms and decades that are just as likely to turn your stomach as entertain. Though this is your last chance, this video is not for the faint of heart. Number 10, Alien vs Predator. This franchise has a great legacy of tension and violence, but never before has the carnage you cause been as visceral as it is here. Playing as one of the three races, you'll be presented with numerous opportunities to brutally kill your rivals. The reward for a successful hunt? Almost always some gut-wrenching gore. Whether it's ripping heads off and spinal cords right out, skewering marines like human shish kebabs, or blowing holes right through xenomorphs, the amount of blood on screen will make even the most desensitized gamer cringe. Number 9. Soldier of Fortune 2 – Double Helix Maybe we've just done it one too many times, but killing nameless grunts in mass numbers really doesn't come with the emotional weight it used to. Cue this title to change all of that though, with the dead and dying soldiers each realistically portraying the damage you caused them in disturbing detail. Take aim at an arm and you can blow it right off, or you can choose to instead spill some guts down to the floor with well-placed bullets to the stomach. Even just aimless fire sprays blood all over the rooms and causes long drawn out deaths that, quite frankly, had us feeling kinda guilty for our enemies. Number 8. The Darkness Jackie Estacado's story of revenge against the mob using the titular darkness entity may not be an obvious inclusion, but beneath the first-person action lies countless moments of memorable brutality which, cumulatively, more than earn the darkness a spot on our list. The stone-cold gunpoint executions that'll tear through the majority of the game's encounters are one thing, but the gorehounds out there will find all manner of creative ways to cause bodily harm by using those serpentine appendages for maximum bloodshed. Want to rip off the faces of your enemies and savor the victory by feasting on the flesh? Go for it! You are nothing but my puppet. Number 7. Resident Evil 7 – Biohazard This ever-popular survival horror franchise has had its disgusting moments before, but with Biohazard, there's more than just piles of rotting corpses to turn your stomach. First, there's the Baker family dinner, and well, let's just say, this game should not be played around mealtime. Yet, things only get more stomach turning from there, as moss literally covers the house everywhere you go to the point where it feels like the house hasn't been cleaned in years. Of course, one of the most stomach churning moments comes from Marguerite Baker, who has an insect nest in her vagina. Need I say more? Number 6 Boogerman A Pick and Flick Adventure. This 1994 title doesn't exactly stand out amongst the Marios and Donkey Kongs of the side-scrolling world, but given the subject matter, it's hard to imagine how this one so often gets overlooked. Sure, it's not disgusting in the blood and guts kind of way, but when your main character is Snotty's alter ego, Boogerman, traveling through booger-coded worlds with, you guessed it, booger-based attacks, we think the game qualifies. Don't think it's a one-trick pony though, because farts and burps also serve as valuable attacks on your quest to stop the Boogermeister in his appropriately named Puss Palace. 
I'll be back. Number 5. Phantasmagoria. While FMV gaming isn't exactly remembered for much other than technical innovation, this title is one that stands out for using the gimmick to its fullest capabilities within its point-and-click gameplay. The writer move to a spooky mansion plot is generic, sure, but at each and every turn, Adrian risks having her brain ripped out of her skull, having her freaking head crushed in half by supernatural beings, or seeing others get stabbed with garden tools or force-fed… whatever that stuff is. <sighs> Sierra Online committed so hard to disgusting their audience that some retailers actually refused to sell the game, while Australia banned it altogether. Peace to you, Victoria. Number 4. Mortal Kombat X It would have been hard to believe 25 years ago that the arcade classic could get even more violent, but here we are. Things escalate quickly in each fight, with every kick and punch showering the screen in blood. But it's the X-ray attacks, with their all-too-real sound effects, giving gamers a front-row seat to the skull-cracking, bone-smashing beatings that will have even the most seasoned MK veterans wincing away from their TVs. Ha! Even the fatalities are cranked up to 11, with stabbings, eye removals, and decapitations being common sights that still somehow never get any easier to look at. <laughs> Number 3. The Binding of Isaac Don't let the cartoonishly cute titular character fool you. This game is probably one of the most disturbed, disgusting titles we've ever sunk hundreds of hours into. On your quest to escape your mom's biblically inspired attack, you'll explode the heads off dead and deformed infants, turning them into nothing more than pools of blood and guts. Isaac also makes use of numerous trinkets like this severed finger as a weapon, and interacts with poop on a fairly regular basis. One of the levels is literally a womb, complete with screaming ghost baby enemies. Number 2. Harvester In this game, the Order of the Harvest Moon tries to turn our amnesiac protagonist Steve into a serial killer. That there should already tell you everything you need to know about Harvester and where it's headed gameplay-wise. Sure, you can die in many graphic ways, but the real disgust factor here comes from the carnage the player causes. Things rapidly devolve into watching acts of cannibalism or murdering a child and his mom in cold blood in their own home. By the time you rip Stephanie's skull and spinal column out of her body, you won't even be shocked, because you'll have seen so much worse already. Wow, that was neat. Not quite at the end yet. Almost there though. Just be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. Alright, back to business. Number 1. South Park, The Stick of Truth don't ask why Kenny wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. If you're a fan of the show, you probably knew this was coming. But for the uninitiated, a word of warning. You'll find some of the crudest, vile shock humor in any video game right here. I am the Prince of Canada, and this is my lovely wife. How can I help you? Bosses include phallic mice and zombified Nazi fetuses in an abortion clinic. You get achievements for watching your parents have sex, and an entire portion of the game takes place right up Mr. Slave's butt with far too much environmental detail. Hurry! Oh, be careful. I might have also put some bats up there the other night. It's offensive and definitely disgusting from start to finish, but it wouldn't be South Park if it wasn't, and that's why we love it. Hon, you and your little druid friends need to- We're not druids, Mom! We're f***ing warriors and wizards! Oh, the 
That's it. You're going to bed. The rest of you better get home too. In the mood for more awesome gaming content? Be sure to check out this video here on Mojo Plays. And don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.